You'll know it's quite expensive. Ow, my legs. I think I just snapped them in two. I'm a soyasus. Do you? So yesterday I managed to get my first chapter of my dissertation in. It wasn't quite complete, but I thought that I needed feedback before I completely finished it. Each chapter can be read once by our um, supervisors. So I thought, like, there's no point completely perfecting it and then having not much to change or, like, not noticing something that needs to be changed. Got feedback on that and I'm going to make a few changes on that today. Hopefully finish those sections as one of the sections is going to be taken out and put into a different chapter. And then I want to start planning the next chapter as I have a meeting on Tuesday. I had a phone call with my doctor last week and I don't know, I feel weird, but I feel like I did need an extension because of the migraines I've been having. I hate asking for like help or extra time or anything like that. I've never asked for it before, but I didn't take it lightly and I do want to do as well as I can. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna accept that I needed a bit bit more time and my doctor agreed with me so i think i think i do need that it won't be much longer i think it's like between five and ten days but i might not even need that time but it sort of helps being able to contact my tutor for longer just in case i was obviously meant to get the chapter in like a week and a half ago and because i've been ill i've not been able to do that so yeah that's why i've applied for the extension it's the only one i've ever had um at uni for the whole three years and I've been ill before, but I've managed to be able to sit with my laptop and do my work because it's not been like debilitating. It might be that I couldn't have got out of bed, but I could still do work. But with a migraine, if you get migraines, you know like how bad it is and that you know you just actually cannot do anything. So I'm not gonna kick myself anymore because I can't help it. It is what it is. I can't I can't get rid of them. So I've been prescribed a new tablet, but they didn't check the interaction with my other tablets, which is ridiculous and negligent, but I didn't take it, so it's okay. But if there's any piece of advice I can give you is Google your medicines before you start taking them because you just never know. Like doctors are so rushed off the feet these days that sometimes mistakes can be made. Like, I don't know, there's just a lot of time strain. So just always check. Like I always go on the, I think it's BNF, and BNF and I type in each of the medications that I take, there's only like three, just to see if they interact. And there was a severe interaction and I spoke to a pharmacist about it and she was like, I can't believe that they've prescribed you that. Seriously, check interacting medications because it's dodgy, dodgy business. I can't decide whether to work at home or to go to like Costa. Do you ever just get like taken in by the um, slideshow on your fire stick? Wow, it's like I'm really there. Been to the shop, bought supplies for the day, put my pajama bottoms on and I think I'm gonna stay in. So I'll show you what I got from the shop. Got an absolute bargain. 10 of these for 50p. So that'll all be for me because Brad doesn't like coffee. I got some coconut milk because I'm gonna to attempt to make my own iced latte because money saving. Can't really say that because I've just bought myself some ice cream, but you know. And then tonight we're being really lazy because Brad doesn't finish work till late. So I've got like a Thai green curry thing. And then I've got him a cottage pie because that's what he likes. I've got him most, I've got him a galaxy. I won't have any of that. <laughs> Do you know, every time I say I don't like galaxy, then when he starts eating it, I'm like, can I have a piece, please? Strawberries. I've not tried this one. I've tried mint choc chip. I can't say that. Mint choc chip, the cinnamon one. Have I tried the vanilla? Maybe the vanilla, I'm not sure, but I, I don't know. I think birthday cake will be quite nice. It's better than Ben and Jerry's, isn't it? Like for you anyway. Although I really want to try the dairy free Chunky Monkey Bell and Jerry's. That sounds right up my street. It's banana and peanuts, walnuts. So I was just looking for a recipe or whatever, something to follow. It says, easy iced latte, five minutes, ready in five minutes. Why is the, this gonna take me like five minutes to read? <laughs> It's literally warm. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I think I've figured out what I'm doing wrong and I think it's because I'm putting too much boiling water. Like it says use hot water and I just use like the kettle or boil the kettle and then probably put about that much hot water in. So it's obviously not gonna cool down. I don't know what 
possessed me. I'm just gonna watch, catch up on doctors, I'm like the middle-aged lady I am. So my verdict on this ice cream is really good. Uh, my favourite is the mint chocolate chip one, but this is actually so nice, I'm well shocked. I think this might be a new favourite. And there's less calories in this tub than there is in the mint chocolate chip one, which is surprising really. So yeah, I'm gonna sit and try and not eat all this and then in about half an hour, I'm going to start working again. I'm just waiting for this headache to go. It's not turned into a migraine yet, but I think it's slowly getting there. I think this is going to turn into a migraine, so I might try and have like a nap for an hour. And then I'm going to get cracking because if I don't relax, then it won't go away. And that's what I've learned recently, especially. Well, I've always known that, but... I just never listen to it and that's why I make myself even worse because I don't give myself a break so I'm gonna take a nasal spray have a have a sleep and then I'll be back I suppose Arnold I'm Arnold hey Arnold first I need to get rid of this migraine because I don't want it to turn into what it's been for the past week <sighs> it's not quite bad yet but it's it's coming I can feel it coming I can feel it night it's actually quarter past five um i had a bit of a nap probably for about an hour been watching a bit of youtube catching up on my doctor's program i've had my dinner which was the thai green curry which was really good uh, it was just the one from tesco like i think you get like two meals for four pounds it's quite low calorie well i say low calorie it's like four, 500 calories so not too bad i feel a bit better now i've had my um migraine spray and a bit of a nap but i'm still knackered <laughs> i think a lot of next week is going to be spent in the library at my actual uni because i am so unproductive when i stay in it's it's ridiculous no it is stupid like i should have gone out today i should have just gone to costa because i would have got a lot more done and i was feeling really like inspired this morning and i've just ended up not doing as much as i should have done but we all have days like that, so yes. I could treat my ice cream. Yeah, I'm probably looking a bit, I don't know what you'd call it. Haggard? Yeah, a bit haggard. Old and haggard. Young and haggard. Uh, if anyone uses Burt's Bees like lip sills, lip sills, like the lip balm, yesterday I was in Boots and I got two for two pound. How good is that? No, it's quite expensive. Ow, my legs. I think I just snapped them in two. Yeah, they've changed the hand sanitizers into these nice little bottles. So they're like the squeezy ones. And they just squeeze out into your hand. And I just thought it was really cute. And I'm a freak when it comes to hand sanitizer. Always have it in my bag. Um, because I hate... I don't know, when I come out of a public bathroom, I just don't feel clean. Some sort of issue, underlying issue, of course. But my hands have been a bit haggard like the rest of me there it is it's hand restoring cream and i think it's a new one gives me um loxatan vibes because it's like you know can you tell like that material you know when you can just tell what material it is but yeah it's really good it smells really nice and that's just good to keep in my bag so happy with that so yeah, I got these Burt's Bees um, lip balms for £2. See, this was the only pack of them which had this £2 sticker on, but it is actually for them. But you get like the vanilla bean one and then just one of the original ones. At the moment, I'm just using the um, chai tea one, which is quite good. I'm still standing. Do you know I said I was waiting for my laptop to charge? Well, it charged about two hours ago. I still not used it. So, conclusion is, I'm just an unproductive bitch. No, I don't know, I don't know. I am just going to start working now, but I'm going to get this edited and up. I don't know, I don't want it to be all about uni, but the thing that's taken over my life at the minute is uni. But at this moment in time, my dissertation is the most important thing and the thing I need to get done and stuff like that. But I want to do more exciting videos. <laughs> it's funny because if you look back, well, you can't look back, but if anyone looked back on my videos from, like, back in the day, well, 2014, oh, wow. Oh, wow. Some of those are so embarrassing. They're all private now because, honestly, I think they'd probably haunt me. Oh, I got a text again. I don't know. It's just my life isn't very interesting at the moment. I'm just having to do work all the time. Let me know what you want to see in the comments and I will get on it. I will get on it. What? Right. Stop trying on. I might do 
a video on my weight loss well my weight loss which hasn't actually happened yet i'm gonna make a separate video about my whole weight and i'm also doing a half marathon in two months and i have done zero training because my leg is injured but yeah i'll update you on that and i think i will start logging my weight loss because i've done it before i've lost the weight and i put it back on but yeah 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 blah, 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 blah. anyway i'll put that in a separate video maybe that'll be my next video let me know if you want to see it and i will see you soon god my hands are huge well, see you soon